Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about my favorite hairstyles to do for my lob. Back in May I cut my hair into an angled short bob and now that it's grown out a little bit it's considered a lob I guess. A lot of people have been sporting this around YouTube and in the fashion world as well. I decided to give you guys three of my favorite hairstyles that I do on a regular basis pretty much as well as hairstyles that will incorporate curly or wavy hair because that is what I have. So to find out my favorite hairstyles just keep on watching. So for this first hairstyle you're just going to need two bobby pins and I'm just going to pull back the bangs or the front pieces of my hair, twist it around and just pin it in the back of my hair and then kind of hide it with the rest of my hair. This is one of my favorite hairstyles to do because it looks very um, girly and chic and at the same time it is so easy to do and so simple but it looks like you put a lot of effort. A lot of people do this with braids but if you're in a hurry I just like to twist it around and just pin it. So what I'm going to do is just take my hair, and I'm going to try and show you guys, but I'm going to put it at the nape of my neck, and I'm not going to grab this too formally, and I want to leave a little bit of the pieces out. So you're just going to twist your hair and loosely tie it. So this is what the finished look looks like, and obviously you could have it as messy or as um, neat as you would like it. I really like to just do a very very loose bun on myself just because I just like that look um, especially with the little pieces, my bangs framing my face. Um, I think it looks very chic and modern. A little modern twist to the bun. The other thing that I do that I have been doing for the past year and a half. It's my little samurai ponytail. I'm sure you all have seen a samurai bun, but I actually just do a ponytail. I don't like the way the bun looks on me. So I'm just gonna show you guys how I do that. For this, I'm just going to take an even smaller scrunchie. This one's a tiny little thing. And I'm going to take my right here, pretty much. It's like the middle of my eyebrows, I believe. And you just go back and kind of do a square. Now you can take as much or as little as you like and I get this very very smooth and I don't know how I do this, I just pretty much just take my hand and make sure my line isn't showing. Then I'm just going to take my small scrunchie and I'm going to turn this into a ponytail. This is a variation on the half up half down. I could never achieve the half up half down. I don't know why but it just didn't work for me. I'm sure you guys have seen this on Sierra and Ava. They all do this all the time. I really like this hairstyle. I think it suits me. I think it suits my hair, face, whatever. This is the last hairstyle that I'm going to show you guys just because it is the easiest thing to do. And if you're going to get a lob, make sure you like having your hair down because that's practically all you're going to have it. If you guys would like me to do any other videos, please leave down your suggestions in the comments below. And if you liked this video and found it helpful, leave a thumbs up and a comment. I really hope you guys like this video and I will talk to you guys later in my next video. Bye guys! You guys are probably wondering how do you achieve a high ponytail? Girl, there ain't no high ponytails anymore. No. There's no more high ponytails for you. You have a lob now. And especially if you have an angled bob lob. Like I do. If I try to put my hair up into a ponytail or a bun, I will have a whole bunch of little hairs just trailing down the back of my neck. And it just ain't cute. It ain't cute. And I hate wearing bobby pins because they just don't hold my hair. If anybody else could do it, I applaud you, but I cannot do it, so I'm not showing it. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking all about my hair and 